hey guys welcome back to my channel welcome back to how we roll cooks today we're in the kitchen and we're gonna be making some juice we're gonna be making tomato pineapple and ginger juice and guys yes don't go anywhere guys look right down below you see that red subscribe button go ahead and click that yes and then look over to your left you see that thumbs up button go ahead and give this video a thumbs up because i know you're gonna love it and this video is was requested by alicia dowdy yes patrice dowdy yes whichever name she's going by yes she requested this video and yeah patrice here we go thank you for sending me this recipe and we're gonna be making this right now and i'm so excited to taste it so here I have my ginger, it's already washed. I have my tomatoes already washed and I am going to peel my pineapple. I am not sure if my juicer can juice the ginger, but yeah, only one way to find out. So now I have my pineapple already. I am gonna move on to my tomatoes. Tomato, tomato. So for the ginger, I am not sure if the juicer is gonna juice it, but let's cut up one of them and see. So now we have everything prepped and ready. We're gonna move over to the juicer. And guys, you see this? He uses it to make juice with ginger. They boil it in the water. I don't know if you guys ever tried that before, but my husband and my mom always boil, this, boil the skin from the pineapple and make juice with it. And it tastes really good. It's just that I don't really have the patience for that. Okay, so we're gonna start off with the pineapples. I'm gonna just put some in here. So guys, this, this is all the juice that I got from the pineapple. So now we're gonna juice the tomatoes.
So I got two cups of tomato juice. Now we're gonna move on to the ginger. So remember, I'm just gonna try and see if it can juice the ginger. So this is this is my ginger juice. I am not gonna throw all of this. I'm gonna throw this gradually and when it reaches to my desired taste, then I will stop because I don't wanna throw this all at once and then it's too strong. So I feel like this is a waste. I'm <laughs> just kidding. So I'm just gonna gradually add my ginger. So guys, like, one thing is gonna happen is the pineapple is gonna separate from the tomato because before I mixed it, Half of it, um, the pineapple juice was down here and then the tomato was settled at the top. So you're gonna have to mix it every time you're ready to pour from the, from, um, the jug, you're gonna have to mix it. Yes, guys. Yes, good. So, guys, how often do you find a juice that is good for your body, but yet delicious? Not very often. So, I implore you to try this juice. It's tomato, ginger, and pineapple. But be careful the amount of ginger you add to the juice. As you can see, I had to leave back some of my ginger. I juice too much, but don't worry, I have use for that. Mm. Shout out to Patrice Dowdy for this recipe. It tastes really good. Let me take a thumbnail. So guys, as you can see, this was a really simple and delicious and healthy juice so go ahead and hit that subscribe button hit the thumbs up and go ahead and try out the juice it's really good really really good all right thank you so much for watching and don't forget to tell a friend to tell a friend check out my playlist it has a lot of videos over there a lot of ingredients both jamaican and international so go over there guys and watch a few of my videos all right and please do not skip the ads